a nation divided, the shadow of segregation. The United States, in the first half of the 20th century, was deeply divided along racial lines. African Americans, despite being citizens, faced widespread discrimination and segregation. This was especially true in the South, where Jim Crow laws enforced separation in schools, buses, restaurants and public spaces. These laws were unjust, denying basic human rights based solely on skin colour. Life for black Americans was a constant struggle for fairness and dignity. This system of segregation was not just a southern problem, it was a national one. While less overt in the north, racial prejudice still permeated housing, employment and education. African Americans were often denied opportunities, subjected to unfair treatment and denied their rightful place in society. The promise of equality enshrined in the Constitution remained unfulfilled for millions. This systemic racism was deeply ingrained in American society, creating a climate of fear and oppression. It was against this backdrop of injustice that the civil rights movement emerged, a powerful testament to the human spirit's yearning for freedom and equality. This movement would shake the nation to its core, demanding change and forcing a long overdue reckoning with its past. The Dream of Equality Goals of the Movement The Civil Rights Movement was a multifaceted struggle with a clear and powerful objective to dismantle segregation and achieve full equality for African Americans. At its heart lay the pursuit of justice, the demand for equal protection under the law and the dismantling of all barriers based on race. The movement sought to eradicate the deeply ingrained system of segregation that permeated every aspect of American life. Equal access to education was a cornerstone of the movement's goals. Separate but equal, the prevailing legal doctrine had proven to be a cruel fallacy, denying black children access to quality education. The movement aimed to integrate schools, ensuring that all children, regardless of race, had equal opportunities to learn and thrive. The right to vote, a fundamental pillar of democracy, was another central focus. The civil rights movement fought tirelessly to eliminate discriminatory voting practices such as literacy tests and poll taxes, which were specifically designed to disenfranchise African Americans. By securing the right to vote, the movement aimed to empower black communities and give them a voice in the political process. The movement also sought to end discrimination in all areas of public life, including housing, employment and transportation. Voices of Change Leaders and Their Visions The Civil Rights Movement was propelled by a constellation of courageous leaders, each with their own unique approach and contribution to the struggle for equality. I am Martin Luther King Jr., a Baptist minister with a powerful message of nonviolent resistance. Inspired by Mahatma Gandhi, I believe in confronting injustice through peaceful protests, love and understanding. Rosa Parks, a seamstress and activist, became an icon of defiance when she refused to give up her seat on a Montgomery bus to a white man. My simple act of courage sparked the Montgomery bus boycott, a pivotal moment in the movement's early years, demonstrating the power of collective action and nonviolent resistance. The boycott lasted for over a year, crippling the city's transportation system and garnering national attention for the cause of civil rights. Malcolm X, a charismatic leader with a more militant approach, challenged the movement's commitment to nonviolence. I advocate for self-defense and black empowerment, believing that African Americans need to achieve liberation by any means necessary. My fiery rhetoric resonates with many, particularly in urban areas, who feel frustrated by the slow pace of change. These leaders, along with countless others, provided the vision, strategy and unwavering determination that drove the movement forward.